Well, the point of an Oxford interview is to identify amongst the many excellent applicants we have, uh, the ones with the potential to do best in our degrees, to learn most from them and to come out of them uh, as well qualified as possible. The point of the interview really is for us to try to match students with the way that we teach. So I see it as trying to find a fit between the candidate and the tutorial system. So people are always think, you know, what's the point of an Oxford interview? The thing for us is all our candidates are really well qualified. That we're, we're really fortunate in that. Um, but it makes it really difficult to tell the difference between people on paper. So the point of an Oxford interview for us, for law, is just to assess the way a candidate thinks through a certain problem question and essentially to assess their critical reasoning ability. We're testing your ability to think logically uh, about a, a situation you've probably not encountered before. You know, we, we will give help and prompts and so often candidates will warm up as the interview goes along. And so do we. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so what we do when candidates arrive for their interviews is we get them all together and we have a big meeting. And the most important point of that meeting is to tell them that just coming here for an interview it's like a huge celebration of their success and their ambition and their achievements to date. It's only one consideration which is weighted exactly the same as your GCSE grades, your A-level grades or predicted grades, uh, your performance on the admissions tests, references, absolutely everything. And it's not more important than any of these things. So the point of the interview really is to help people, help people get a place. I think that's the real point.